Hi guys, Potmaster here, and today I'm going to be unboxing the new Batman Collector's Box from Target. So let's get started. Alright, so I have the box in here, so let's get this one open first. And... Uh, here we go. Alright. I don't want to show you guys the back because it actually shows off the um, characters. But yeah, here's the box here. And before I open it, I just want to talk about a couple things first. So first, as you guys can probably notice, I'm filming a new location. I know you might not be able to see my face too well. I'm going to try and move around so you guys can. But yeah, so, um, yeah, maybe, I think here is good, yeah. So I'm actually filming outside of my porch. Yeah, it's, it's a really cool view, and if it's not windy, then it's usually pretty good lighting. And... I don't know, I might build some stuff out here, so. Oh, second thing. Um, I have a New York Comic Con, so I have most of my stuff that's either already here or coming. I think I have two packages in so far, which is um, Barnes & Noble and FIE, so I'm winning some other, from other ones like Hot Topic and the Funko Shop. So when those come in, I'll do a huge unboxing. It'll probably be maybe, I don't know if it'll be ready for Monday, but definitely by Wednesday, probably Wednesday, maybe, maybe Friday. I don't know, but we'll see. Just some stuff has been coming in earlier. So yeah, let's get on with the video. Alright, so moving on, I'm going to sort of dive into the main topic of today's video, which is this box. And yeah, so this is the um, this is Bat this is the Batman uh, DC Collector's Box from Target. And what I think this is supposed to be is that this is sort of the new... Um, I think Target's going to be where the new, uh, what's called, Legion of Collectors is going to go. Because if you guys remember, that was when Legion of Collectors was the DC-themed subscription bo box program that Funko had. And they, they did discontinue it back in March, so it's been since March that they've had a box. So a total of seven months, a bit long, considering Marvel Collector Core only had a two-month wait between its last box in April and then uh, the Deadpool one, which is in June. But yeah, I, mean, I was really happy to get this one just because Batman's probably my... Like, Paired superhero and the only one I really like, and yeah, you can you guys. Um, unfortunately, this um, wait, never mind. I'll, I won't say anything. So as you, as you guys can see on the box, there it is. There's four items in here, so it says four pieces, and then one pair, which is kind of a spoiler. But yeah, there's the Batman and the Penguin there. Penguin has like smoke coming out of some Blurella, and there's the logo there. And I'll show you guys the side here, and it has kind of this classic, I guess, sound effects. You know, zap, pow. Uh, what's the other one? Uh, ARG, yeah, so, there's that, and also says more of that on the other side, and then the DC logo down there, and I don't want to show you guys the back, because unfortunately the back has everything that's in the box on there, so that's kind of, um, annoying, just because I feel like that kind of ruins the whole point of a mystery box like this, so you don't know what's inside, yeah, so I can see everything here, and I already, I already knew what was in it, but also in the promotional thing, they said everything was in it as well, so that's kind of annoying. I hope they don't do that in the future, but they probably will. And here's the top, it just says Batman Classic TV Series. And now I'm going to open it up to show you guys how the box is laid out. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Ah! Oh, I heard something fall out. Okay. So yeah, there's some stuff here. Let's start with the first item, which is actually a pair of pop magnets here. And this is the Batman and the Joker here. So there's that. Sorry, the lighting's not great, but there we go. So this is actually a really cool set. It's a pair of magnets, and I'm honestly happy they did this item instead of, you know, like a, I don't know, like a keychain or something like that. But I feel like they don't make too many of these. But yeah, so let's take them out of the packaging. I actually have this, they're actually glued onto here, which is nice. So here we go. And the magnet is on the back right there. That's cool, and this is pretty much exact. This looks exactly like the Batman pop from this show. So yeah, this is pretty detailed, and I feel like this will look, look great on my fridge. So yeah, there's the Batman. This is classic TV, um, classic TV series. The logo there. That's cool. And then yeah, there's the Joker. Sorry, spoil that early, but here he is here. And I just like the feel of this material on the back here. I know it's not really. It's kind of a random thing. Oh, and something about this one, the Joker actor in the show, is that if you guys can look, you, he actually has a mustache, which he's not supposed to, but the only reason they have that in his character is because the actor actually refused to shave off his mustache to 
film the parts. They just kind of, you know, they pinned it over it. But you can still see it in the show and on this. So I'm happy they had that detail. But yeah, it's just a Joker. You know, he has, you know, white face, green hair, you know, blue suit. Kind of basic. Yeah, still looks pretty cool, though. And here is the two of them here. So yeah, this is a really cool item to have in the box. Let's go on to the next thing, which is actually the wearable here. And we actually have a pair of socks. And these are sort of themed. They aren't really exactly from the show. Well, the, not really. It's kind of like what, what I showed you on the side of the box. It has all the different sound effects. You know, like, pow. Uh, I can't really, like, splat. You guys, I can't see the whole word, but, yeah, here they are here. Yeah, there's, yeah, that's sort of like what the sock looks like. And they have the Batman logo up, up there. So that's pretty cool. And it's actually colored. In the regular colors. So these are some cool socks. Yeah, alright. Let's move on to the next thing. There's some pops in here, but I'm going to stick to the other item. Oh! oh okay, this is weird. Okay, hold on. Give me one second, guys. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Okay, I'm all good. Here we have a Hero World pack, actually, of Batman and Catwoman. So this is really cool. This is another, um, uh, yes, vinyl figure line that Funko makes. They have, they made, um, I think the only ones that come out so far, exclusive to Target, they have ones like, they have, I think, like DC and uh, Power Rangers and other stuff like that. I don't, this is the first pack I've ever gotten. And what I don't like is that you can't really take these out of the box without ripping up the entire packaging. Which is kind of annoying. You can't just put them back in here because then you, you lose this thing, so. It's Batman and Catwoman. Here's the back. I'll take him. I will take him out because I don't collect these or anything. And there she. There they are. There. And then here's the front. So let's open them up. It says series eight. So I guess they made eight different series of these. I don't know how that works. Remember when I originally opened this, I thought that was just this ins this insert with nothing, no actual packaging, but it's not because it's only a two-pack. Alright, these are a lot smaller than I actually thought they would be, to be honest, so let's, I don't know. Okay, how am I going to get them out here? Alright, so I'm back. I got some scissors. I'm going to cut them out here. Alright, here is Batman, and Catwoman, alright, so these are pretty small figures, I mean, nothing too big, so yeah, there's Batman here, kind of just a basic Batman figure, I guess, he has his uh, fingers out and he has this cool cape there, so this is pretty cool, not a huge action figure person, but yeah, this is still kind of cool to have. And what I'm more excited about is Catwoman. She actually has a jewel here, and her outfit is glitter. So that's really cool. I like this one, and I like the hair with the ears. So, yeah, this is a really cool two-pack that I get. So, all right. So, it's three things. And now for the grand finale, we have a Funko Pop two-pack of Batman and the Penguin. Look at this one, guys. This one looks awesome. There's the side, Penguin, and Batman, and then here's the back, some other characters from this line. This is a really cool two-pack. I think I'm going to take this one out of the box. Oh, it already fell off. Okay. Wow. These look great. All right. Let's start with... Oh, oh. <laughs> Start with Batman here. So there he is here. He's in a little, he's in action pose. He's meant to sort of be facing Penguin, on the other side of him, and he has this little I think it's like an underwater breathing thing or something. You know, you know, like the look on his face. He has like the eyebrows down. That's really cool there. And it's just a really cool pop to have. It's a, I feel like it's a lot better than just the regular Batman from the show. And then here's the Penguin. This is actually a pretty heavy pop compared to the regular ones, and he's in his little. Uh, shirt and tie and bow tie and his dress shoes and his white gloves and his pink hat and he also has this cool monocle there which i like and the nose is a lot more pointed which is kind of fitting with his character and the 
puff of smoke out of his umbrella looks great as well. And I just like how detailed they did this one because there's no, I don't know, no paint or anything weird with this. His hair looks good as well. It's nice and, I don't know, I like the look of it. Yeah, and I want to show you guys them both side by side here. So, it would look like this if you saw it in the box. Yeah, really cool set. Pretty heavy pops though, but I, I like this. I don't remember what um, show, sorry, what uh, part of the show that this is from. I've only seen a couple episodes of it, but I don't know. But yeah, this has been another, yeah, thank you, uh, this has been another episode of Pop Master. Me opening up the new Batman DC Collector's Box from Target. This is a, they got some really cool stuff in here, and I hope they make more of these cool Batman theme boxes in the future. Thank you guys so much for watching, and have a great day.